that chuck talk. You ain't built like that. You ain't hop in the Chevy and bring that shit man back. You ain't been in the ghetto and sold them bricks like that. I'm just spinning my story and it be shit like that. All that tough talk. You ain't built like that. You ain't hop in the Chevy and bring that shit man back. You ain't been in the. Hey yo, what up? Be okay in this motherfucker. It's gonna be okay in this motherfucker. Like, comment, subscribe, share, dislike, do all that. I'm gonna leave a Patreon and a link in the description because motherfuckers be looking at me weird and funny and just be, you already know what's going on. But <clears throat> also, and I'm gonna leave the link in the description for my other channel. I'll be putting little stuff over there. I don't really be going in that hard. I just be like putting shit over there to like get them to like, oh, this nigga's just a crazy motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? Just until like, but when like, the, if they ever really do take my shit off, I'ma just, you know what I'm saying, convert all the way over to that channel. So that's why I'm telling y'all, you know. To, uh, check that channel out too. But anyway, I discussed this before, but they took it down. But I'm just gonna talk about this shit that needs to be t talked about because motherfuckers like to tell you to, you know what I'm saying, how to do shit and what to say on certain platforms. So I'm just gonna talk about, you know what I'm saying, not taking shit lightly so much. So when y'all hear the number 12, you know what I'm saying? You already know, 12 on the clock. You know what I'm saying? Jesus and his disciples is 12. All that good shit. But 12 also means rulership. You see what I'm saying? So when y'all niggas be running around saying, oh, there go 12, fuck 12. Y'all really saying there go our rulers, there go our masters, there goes the people that we should bow down to and get on our knees and pray and worship. This is why when you was in school, your ruler had how many inches on it? Your ruler. You understand what I'm saying? So this is why Y'all calling people rulers and gods, and this is why you got the God symbol. You feel what I'm saying? So, also, um, for, like I, I was talking about the tree of life and those trees, so, you know what I'm saying? <clears throat> for those trees, you got to understand this is a natural thing because there's no way you could be able to lick a toad and come up with the same outcome. Like, how can a toad give you the same type of, you know what I'm saying, experience that a, a plant does? You feel what I mean? Like, how is that even possible? How is that even possible? You gotta understand that there are magical creatures right in front of your face they be painting as, you know what I'm saying, regular shit. You know what I mean? So, you gotta understand that this is not what it seems. You know? And also, I want y'all to understand when y'all dealing with these spirits, the succubus spirits, she suck, you bust. You know what I'm saying? These energies is not going to leave you until you leave them alone. Understand that. Y'all be feeling like, oh yeah, uh, I need to be cleansed, orally cleansed. Your aura needs to be cleansed. Nigga, you need to leave them spirits alone. Facts. Like, this is one of the main reasons why you're in the same position you're in. You know what I mean? You have to leave those spirits alone, bro. So when you looking at, you know, these certain women and you like, they all have something in common, you know what I'm saying? Or these men and they all have something in common. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta meditate and find out what this thing that they have in common is. You know what I'm saying? Like seriously.
Because you could be in love with a whole, like I said, you could be in love with a whole demon and not even understand it because it's niggas that, it's, it's women and, and niggas and gods and goddesses, human beings and all type of motherfuckers that like shit that they don't understand. You know what I mean? You looking at, you got to think. Why do all of these people like, you know what I'm saying? It's a group of people that like thug-ass niggas or thug-ass women or crazy psycho women or, you know what I'm saying, motherfuckers that want to take you on romantic shit all the time, romantic dates and shit. It's the energy that's in, that resides inside that person that you're in love with. It's not the person. It's the energy inside the person. Because you could look at a thick chick, you know what I'm saying, that's from the hood, and then look at a thick chick that's from the suburbs, and a lot of motherfuckers ain't going to pick the same chick. You know what I'm saying? And a lot of motherfuckers is going to pick both chicks because they are so, they're at a point where they don't even know themselves who they are. That person is already... You know what I'm saying? Being taken over completely. Because they don't even have a type of person that they like. Understand that. They're not looking for a specific energy. Understand that. They're looking for whatever they can feed off of. So, this is how you know what type of motherfuckers you dealing with. When they, I don't got no time. All that shit. You just feasting off motherfuckers like a vampire. <sighs> All right, so don't take it, don't take, don't take everything so lightly. When you see, you know what I'm saying. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Before I go into that, I want to make sure. I want to make sure. You know what I'm saying. I want to make sure. I told y'all. I wanted to make sure. I told y'all. So so far we got. All that shit, especially that we was giants, you know what I'm saying? And, you know what I mean? We were giants. A lot of giants. Still got Shaquille O'Neal. You know what I'm saying? Y'all mean. You know what I mean? Motherfuckers like that. And I'm going to show you this clip, but before I show you this clip, I want you to understand and understand that also there were uh, what the fuck is a cyclops then if if there were no giants what the fuck is a cyclops why do they always reference cyclops what the fuck is that is that just a big ass giant with one third big third eye or what the fuck is going on with that because y'all mentioned that in so many movies and shit it's like I'm curious to know what the fuck y'all got going on So check this clip out. Now you now you can't tell me that that shit don't 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 look weird to a lot of motherfuckers if y'all ain't seen that shit before. You know what I'm saying? If you niggas don't believe in giants, y'all gotta understand. Y'all can't take this shit lightly, bro. Look at that shit. You can't tell me that motherfucker don't look like it was put to sleep or it's in a sleeping position. Like, why are you in a sleeping position? Why is it a whole giant in a sleeping position? That motherfucker could have been made. Listen, y'all gotta understand. That motherfucker could have been made out of nature. You know, because they reference that a lot too. It could have been made out of nature. It, they could have put a spell on that motherfucker to put it to sleep. They could have frozen that motherfucker, you know what I'm saying, drug it to that, you know what I'm saying, that 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 area and or that, you know what I'm saying, what, what motherfuckers like to call dimension, because different areas give you different type of, you know what I'm saying, I'm going to go into that later, but uh, I want y'all to like understand that this motherfucker, it could have been anything. I don't know the story behind that shit. 
I just feel like anything could have happened. It could have been a gang of motherfuckers that then shot at this bitch because th there was a whole lot of shits, instances, and movies where they showed that type of shit. A whole lot of people shooting at this giant to get it down when really the giant was really cool. But they didn't, they don't want motherfuckers to, you know what I'm saying, exist with them, which is ridiculous. V five four phone. Come on now. But uh, now and then watch this, watch this. So if y'all don't, also if y'all don't, y'all just gotta stop taking shit lightly. So when Kevin Hart said, "Adira," said, "Yeah, damn." He said, I got a disease. I was like, you got that Benjamin Button. He was like, where's my dear bruh? I said, I knew that was a fucking dear bruh. I knew it was. I just took it to the zoo. He was like, well, how the fuck am I supposed to get home? How the fuck are you supposed to get home? So it's like, is that like, are you referencing to like magical creatures? Like, like small little elf type shit joints? Like hopping on like reindeer type shit or like, or what the fuck were you trying to say? I said, you ride that motherfucker, man? All right, all right, all right. Got that understood. Now I want to go in the flash, the superhero. So this motherfucker, you know what I'm saying, is, uh... Flash is vibrating high, so fucking high, that he's moving at the speed of light. You understand what I'm saying? And the only and the reason why he's vibrating that high is because he's enlightened. You know what I'm saying? You gotta go in to see the light for your mentality. Enlightenment. You understand what I'm saying? He's enlightened. You got to see that light, you understand what I'm saying? So he moves lightning fast, you understand? So, with that being said, he's vibrating so high that you can't even see him when he moves. Y'all got to understand that he's vibrating high, so when you vibrate high, when you're vibrating high, a lot of motherfuckers not going to be able to see you. Facts. Get that understood. So, I just want y'all to understand not to take everything so lightly when you're looking at shit. Because that's the power of a motherfucker. Like, watch, like, it's literally like the bad guys when, ha, 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 I'm going to tell him. We're gonna slaughter every single last one of you motherfuckers. Piece by piece, one by one. First, I'm gonna take this guy right here. He's gonna be my right hand man. He's gonna go in, he's gonna pretend like he works at the place, and he's gonna kill about 50 people. And like, they tell you their story on how they wanna do it. And this is how they do it in front of your face at all times. So, y'all, be aware.